Welcome to the show. I'm Kathy Ireland. Oftentimes, we don't give much consideration to the air we breathe or the surfaces we touch. Warren Lynn, president and CEO of American Air and Water, says it's time for greater awareness about the need for infection control to limit the spread of diseases and present a first line of defense in an epidemic or a pandemic. Welcome, Warren. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you for having me. It's a pleasure to be here. Warren, typically we ask about the future towards the latter part of our interviews, yet I understand you feel it is important to address it right out of the gate. So please tell us about the future of light. The first part is our business for the last 20 years has been all about air, water, and surfaces, food, food processing. It's all about light and it's all about the sun and everything under the sun. So as we've learned the infection control business over the years, we've developed a new process, a better process of light, and this allows us to take care of the air we breathe, the water we drink, the food we eat. Those are the three most elements of life. Right. And you have to have light. Right. So our business is those four elements and that opens up the opportunities for enormous businesses, especially any business that is a disruptive business in the healthcare industry, wanting to make a healthier, cleaner, better environment, better light, and infection control. I'm an internist. I see many types of viral illnesses and bacterial illnesses in my daily practice. It is a worldwide problem. We have epidemics every few years and they're getting worse. The products from American Air and Water are designed to help eliminate viruses such as the flu virus and other viruses, bacteria and fungi. I think it will be incredibly important in the future considering how many epidemics we see. Our lighting and disinfection fixture is designed to be scalable. It can be installed in small uh, residential settings, in dormitory rooms, or in, in large facilities, uh, commercial offices, doctor's offices, food processing plants. It can be a small fixture installed over the bed or a large two by four recessed trophers for uh, larger settings like in food processing plants. Warren, can you talk about the color of light and the effects that it has on our bodies? Different colors can affect our moods. We suffer from malillumination. That's why we gravitate towards going outside and getting some fresh sunshine. The patent has allowed us to have all wavelengths of light with automatic disinfection. The importance of the color of light changes with the day and the effects and the time and the mood and the environment. Warren, how does this pertain to the current state of infection control? Well, it has a, a huge impact. First of all, the viruses and the flus and, and what we see in this crazy world and how things spread faster and faster and become resistant to drugs. And you know, even this past year, we had multiple strains of the flu. And, and with that, uh, the, the flu shots couldn't keep up with the, the different strains that were out there. And so um, knowing that there is at least 40% of the population who's sick, they still go to work. They go to work because they need the money. They don't want to let down their coworker. They don't want to let down their boss. And so that has a tendency to allow things to spread. Hospital workers, they go to the hospital, they're sick. We just received uh, notice from the school. Again, on the safety issues, a big part of it is the health issues because one child gets sick, mm -hmm. then it passes, tag, you're it. It seems like a game of tag, they bring it home. And so with automatic disinfection, without knowing where you are, our ultraviolet lights that are doing indirect disinfection, 
in the air right. would rotate and come down direct. So it would sterilize the surfaces that where we're sitting and where, where we've been and also help with the airflow. So it creates for a healthier environment, mm -hmm. more productivity, sure. less absenteeism in wherever you go, and just a safer, cleaner environment. Disinfection is very important indoors because artificial light doesn't provide the ultraviolet part of the spectrum and uh, bacteria can get airborne and thrive in that environment. That's why we have added a germicidal ultraviolet system to our lighting to constantly disinfect the air that flows through it. One of the major things that this company will do is to help eliminate bacteria and viruses and hospital-acquired infection, which can lead to terrible illness and death inside a hospital. It's one of the main focuses today of healthcare. I don't know of anybody else that's, that's changing a hospital environment for the better so we can eliminate these terrible uh, infections. We have antibiotics and we have other things, but there's nothing new in that field. This is the answer to infections in hospitals. Well, Warren, it sounds like using UV technology is lighting the way to a healthier future. Congratulations to you, and thank you for joining us today. Thank you very much for having me. It was a pleasure to meet you and be on the show, Kathy. Thank you. Thank you for watching. I'm Kathy Ireland.